How's it going, everybody? Triple Dunk here, back on, you guessed it, Tomb Raider. Uh, we ended off with this lovely, beautiful, sunny scene of the ocean and of the ship that we have to go into and save Alex from. Whatever danger lies away. Lars, totally right. Something seriously fucked up is going on here. The natural phenomenon that causes the weather to go ape shit, the military research base, some kind of sun queen, and a crazy cult. I mean, if I didn't know better, I'd say this is a big put on. Are there TV cameras hidden in the trees? I mean, you know, I, I gotta admit, it's scaring the shit out of me. I, I keep cracking jokes to cover it up. Reyes looks ready to kick my ass. I think I need to do something useful before I completely lose it. I wish I could be more like Lara. She just... <laughs> she blows me away. Not only is she brilliant, but she's also an amazing ass kicker. Now, if she didn't notice me before, she sure as hell won't now. But maybe I can still do something to get her attention. So you went off in a little adventure of your own just to get Lara's attention. Already is a badass? I mean, come on, Lara is pretty badass. Don't get me wrong. Look at her, he got some stuff earlier. Okay. But then again, she didn't get that upgrade all by her. She didn't become a badass just by herself. She got, you know, Ross training, and, you know, her genes, and her bloodline, and all that stuff made her awesome. So. And plus, she's just an awesome person. My okay. Up to the endurance! Full of bad guys. Here. Oh. You two, go restack that cargo for transport after you finish with that. Oh, big boy. It won't. But. Out of the way. I got this. You. Hey, big boy. I missed you. Ah! Ah, no! Ah! Oh. Okay. I love how he's armored everywhere except his head. You'd think he would have a helmet. What is this? A little rat? I'll show you what a little rat can do. Ah, no! Ah! Ah! Whoa, she's getting violent now. Oh, you never mess with this little rat. Never. Oh, she is badass. Oh, that is handy. That's cool. Right. Okay, let's just, uh,. I have Lara to thank for this job. 
She's always believed in me. The academics at college dismiss filmmaking as nonsense. They just saw me as this ditzy American troublemaker with the camera. But you know what? Most people can use a little trouble in their lives. And deep down, I know Lara just wanted to cut loose sometimes. She just needed a little help unlocking her inner party girl. We had so many awesome adventures together. That insane backpacking trip through Bulgaria. <laughs> I was always dragging her out to clubs. And the hiking trip on the south face of Kilimanjaro. All Lara wanted to do was explore ruins. <laughs> but who knew we'd run into so many cute guys? Certainly not Lara. <laughs> I have a feeling this expedition is going to be one for the books. Lara with her notebook, me with my camera, another crazy adventure. You have no idea how much you write, Sam. <laughs> Now the hook got it. 
Okay. Finally. All right. You guys want to see any of that crap? Oh, Alex. You got the door. Finally. I impress you. Let's get you out of here. Oh, God. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Uh, well, that looks like my dance career is over. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, there's more assholes. What are you doing? You'll kill us. I'm not going to make it out of here, Laura. Take the tools. Not without you. How often does a guy like me get to be a hero? Ah! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Losing friends left and right. No one around! The others are counting on us. Go! Now! Months of excavation has at last yielded new information concerning the weather patterns gripping this island. The tomb of an important general dating from the Kamakura period was discovered in our coastal dig site. This discovery is the missing piece of the puzzle. It will allow us to finally gain control of the storms. Sounds cool, buddy. I don't think you need to discover that. Ancient ruins in the old base. Control over the storms. I need answers. Get 
back to the camp. No arguments. Just get your shit together. We head out in ten. That place is a fight. Help! Ah. There you go! I can do that. Come on, leave me alone. Anyone caught with you has a pretty low survival rate. Reyes! Better keep your distance, son. Let's just eat, okay? Those bastards went quiet, but it doesn't mean they're gonna stay that way. If I'm going to die in this place, I'm not gonna do it hungry. Hmm. Oh, I remember that dude, Tonto. Save a man's uh, stomach, save his dude soul. Dude from Gears of War that Jonah looks like. Fine. I don't know why it reminds me so long of that. Once Reyes finishes the boat, we'll be back to civilization in no time. And what a tale we'll have to tell. A tale? I hope I never hear Himiko's name again. We can take the boat out at high tide. No, we can't. Don't start that bullshit again, Lara. Lara isn't the only one who thinks we're trapped, Reyes. Matthias may be insane, but he was certain about it. I saw it in his eyes. He thinks resurrecting Himiko is the key to getting off this island. God, it sounds crazy. This whole place is crazy. These storms aren't natural. We have to face that. She's right. When that storm hit the Endurance, I felt it. Something dark, something alive. This place is cursed. Where are you going? There are ruins beneath that old base in the cliffs. Something in there led them to believe they could control the storms. I've got to find out what they discovered. Once we're ready to leave, we're leaving. Whether you're back or not. I won't leave without you. Sheesh, what's up with 
Ray is hitting, hating on me. These islanders are absolutely insane. Those poor people from the endurance, so, so tragic, but honestly, it adds to the drama. Not only is this the mythical land of Yamatai, but the shipwrecks and the, the modern day cultist, it warrants at least two documentaries, maybe even a series. Oh Lord, this place is going to ignite the world's imagination and, and I'm going to be right in the center of it all. Such a huge, Relief. All my chips were on this one number. I just need to be careful now. This situation could spin out of control on a dime. Once I have this Matthias fellow's ear, I, I can convince him that there's much to gain in cooperating. I mean, he can't honestly believe the things he preaches to these men, right? They're, they're just lost and confused. I'll help to bring them all back to civilization. The spirit. Sponsors. Oh, the sponsors are going to line up for this exclusive. The story is huge. Okay, why don't people like Whitman, who are obviously crazy with fame and fortune, die, and yet good people like Grimm and Roth and freaking now Alex? Come on. Why don't they live? Man, it's always the good people. Sorry to say it, but... Obviously, I guess it's true. And yet you get crazy Whitman over here.
check. Well, can't take that way back. Guess I just had to jump for my life. Or climb down like a normal being. That works too. Stop raping the wall, Laura. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I just had it. I just had to suppress it. Okay. Salvageables. What the hell are we doing here? It's fucking Odie in that tomb. Calm down. We got orders from the man. No one goes in or out. They kill anything that sets foot in there. You been listening to the OMS crew? Yeah, they said some guys went in there on a salvage job and never came out. They're fucking with you, brother. Those bozos like to make shit up. Don't believe any of them. What the hell? You need help here! Yeah, well, no one can help you now. Just... Oh, except you. I'm coming for you. Come on. Oh yeah, I forgot I added a uh, incendiary bolts to my shotgun. So yeah. Okay, gotta get this stuff from him. All right. Now I.
So now it appears I'm at the research base, and hopefully I find out what causes these storms. It's probably Himiko, though. Um, you know, sure. But... Oh, I just went around the wrong way. <laughs> I'm up. Oh, closer. After we discover the tomb, they came. The Oni. First, the lights went out. Then, then the screaming started. Was it us or them? That horrible sound. It still rings in my head. They wore the armor of my ancestors. They, they, they cut us down with ancient blaze. Gunfire, shouting, blood. We couldn't stop them. Everything turned to chaos. And then, silence. They were gone. Why did they leave? Why didn't they kill us all? Captain Osaka is in command now. We... We are leaving the base. But not the island. We are heading inland. To the monastery. There is no other way. We must follow the Oni. All of us. If we can't control the star, we must destroy it. But I know, we, we are all going to die. Okay, that's a little melodramatic, but uh, yeah, everyone's freaking out about uh, these legendary Oni warriors from like Himiko's time. But uh, let's get fired. Ah, oh, it's enemies. Just you, or is it somebody else? Okay. Okay. So... No, I didn't want you to drop Alright, well... I'm at the research base right now. The research lab, whatever you like to call it. And... If I'm going to get to the ritual chamber in that monastery, we need to fix that boat. I don't know how I'm going to convince the others to take it inland rather than off this island, but I have to find a way. Reyes won't be easy. She wants to get back to her daughter, and she's in pain over Roth. We all are. I still don't know exactly why Matthias wanted Sam in the first place. It doesn't matter. She's back with us now. She's safe. Okay, got some napalm arrows, so expect some awesome flamage in the next episode. Because, holy crap. That was a lot of climbing. And, uh, yeah, next time we get to experience the Oni, the big, badass motherfuckers from, like, ancient times. So. Until then, hopefully you guys liked it, and uh, see you uh, next time. Triple Dunk, signing off.